with a solution for anyone that has a laptop or desktop with USB 3.0, USB-C or USB-A and doesn't have any extra HDMI outputs to connect extra displays. This is the Aureus Split Extend SX2C 4K that will allow us to extend up to two displays at 4K 60 and inside the package all we will find is the split extent and also a quick user guide which I believe that you won't require. Let's check it out. You can go up to 4K at 60 Hz on both displays over USB Type-C or USB Type-A and it's also compatible with computers with USB 3.1 or even Thunderbolt so no issues whatsoever just above 3.0 it will work just fine. At this moment I've got a Windows 11 computer wire over here which I can use as normal with two displays but it does support other operating systems. Now if I go right over here I can just browse and work with two displays and and if I go to my display options, we can see that it has these two displays here and another one which is my HDMI output, which I did disconnect right now for these tests. And let's open here our browser on the Aureus website. I can be browsing here and I can be gathering info from other app or from a folder, for example, and then we don't waste any time. Now using a macOS computer, which in this particular case has Thunderbolt 4, ports on this MacBook Pro for example connected to the split extent and we can also have access up to 4K at 60Hz and in this particular case I just did the displays as individual displays so that we can have a extended display. In this particular case we have the display built in for the laptop but we also have these two available right over here. Samsung S20 Fan Edition which is connected via USB Type-C to the split extent and at this moment I'm only using one display. I can connect up to two displays but they will be duplicated so if I want to have a bigger screen and then do whatever I need to do on my phone I can do so right over here and for example in apps such as YouTube if we want to turn it horizontally to occupy more of the space of our display then we can just select full screen and it will display full screen right over here in this particular case is showing these bars here but the image is much larger and if I go to back then it will revert to go to the duplicated and it will show exactly what we have on screen.